What is happening, y'all? Cowboy here. Welcome back. Before we set off, looks like our friend here has a quest for us. Ah, the mighty Mistios. You've proved yourself capable before. I could use your talents. One like you is always interested in more drachmi, yes? Always happy to hear the clink of drachmi. Tell me what you want. I have an appetite for rare treasures. I've heard many veiled rumors and provocative stories, and I want you to recover some of these lost wonders for me. Tell me where to look, and I'll bring you these treasures. Have you heard of the mighty Ajax? One of Homer's heroes? Yes. He had a golden eagle feather, a gift from Zeus. And why do you care about it? It is a rare reminder of a glorious age, and so deserves to be in my grasp. Take these maps and see if you can find it. What can you tell me about Ajax's feather? The son of Talamon was said to be a fearless giant. Some say the golden feather that gave him courage was woven into a shield crafted of seven ox hides. The shield is long destroyed, but Zeus's feather remains. I'll find this feather for you, if it's there to be found. Huh. Room and feather locations. So treasure maps in your quest item to find the lost treasures. Oof. Alright, well, that'll be a lot of fun, but we're not doing all that right now. Um, let's knock out escort service, just because we're already over here. I mean, it was 8,000 from here. It's only 4,000. Well, 4,600. But anyway, we'll do that real fast. Actually, no. No. First, we'll do you. And then we'll sail on out. That makes the most sense. And get this engraving done while I'm here. Welcome. Crit damage. I could go fire damage. Hmm. I am doing a lot of burning lately. Why not? Let's go fire. Building towards it. And I want to sell my trade goods. 28,000! <laughs> yes. That is what I like. There is the damn dock. I know it's like right around here. Wow, way down here. Escort Cleo to Mykono. And I'm going the right way, right? Yes. Ah, there it is. This kind of money, I could easily upgrade pretty much whatever I wanted. I will get the address to you here. I will sail out to kill the cultist man. Take a look at some ship stuff real quick here. Um, only health and armor. Bill, bracing damage reduction, fire damage reduction. Like, I want to grab upgrades, but Jesus, they are so freaking expensive. Evelyn, weak point creation. Maybe I could grab, like... Oh no, damn, these gotta... Man, all this stuff, it costs the, the ancient tablets. Ramming damage, weak point creation. Javelin damage, weak point creation. Arrow damage, weak point creation. Let's do arrows. The arrows are what we use the most. The left the helm. Wait a minute. And what was that other upgrade?
things. Man. Looks like a storm, Commander. Let's go. Fast as we can. A storm will stop me from murdering my enemies. I'm surprised this cultist isn't like I mean, you know, considering this whole thing was like he, he seemed like he was going to be a sea cultist. Figured I'd find him out here. Wars at the ready. We're at maximum speed. That's something here. I think if you like or up before you go into travel mode. Like somehow get you going faster because it does feel like I'm looking at that number. I'm using that, and I feel like it does seem to be counting down faster than it was before. nice to actually just like spend a whole night recording like, following up I think it was the last episode when I was talking about how I'm, you know, it's late and I'm debating if I want to do a stream or you know, uh, go to bed but I mean oh no here we go here's a ship awesome but it's uh it's like 5 a.m. but I mean the last couple weeks I just haven't had the time to actually uh, record you know so it's like on a day-by-day -day basis I've been recording so this is the first time in a while I've actually been able to, you know, really like, just spend the whole day, or the, the whole night, I should say, recording. Which is really nice. Like, I mean, it's, you know, it's great to, to record, like, on a day-by-day -day basis, because I can, you know, actively add in commentary relating to that day prior for the episode. But at the same time, it's also really nice to have a couple of days done in advance, because, you know, then it's not, you know, it's, it's I'm ahead of the curve, if you will. Who the fuck? ships are part of him or what but I need to nope he's sick damn it I don't know who these other ships are but they got in the fucking way in a big way I don't know if they're part of his crew I don't think they were but the one jackass literally sailed between me and him What the hell? What kind of save is this? Where am I at? Just spawn me in the middle of the the what? No, 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 no. no. Going after this dude. I'll have to scan before I get close to him. Because if he has minion ships with him, I'll need to take those down. Growing speed. We're at full speed.
my Ikiros range is, but, I'm, but again, it's hit 500. I mean, I don't think anybody's with him, you know? A couple of just ships in the vicinity, but... I have Cosmos Cultist. Pirate. Pirate. Got him. Hi, pirate nerds. I figured I would have to board, but nope. You can just cleave his ass in half. Easiest cultist ever. So let's take a look at the goodies we got. You dropped a spear. Warrior, Hunter, and Crit. Eh. This one's cooler if I'm going to use a spear, but I'm not. I'm going to go back to that. Uh, gauntlets. Everybody's dropping gauntlets. Ah, it's an assassin set. Well, we can hard pass on that. Around this? Where am I going? Around this island. And curve on in. Mykonos. Ready for docking. There's much to do, and many unknowns on our horizon. You've more than made up for killing my abductors, Mistios. Thank you. Try to stay out of trouble, all right? I'll consider it. Put my coins to good use and wish me luck. Good luck. What? 
five hundred is all you paid me for this? Ooh, twelve thousand five hundred XP though. What is happening? Okay, that's what I'm talking about. Thank you. Abilities. Ugh, do I? I don't think I need this. Like I build stuff up so freaking fast already. It just seems unnecessary, you know. And then I could level that up. That's fun. Assassination knockout damage are up by 10%. Crit damage is... Oh, 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 yes, yes, yes. Let's just do that. Crit damage is increased. Percent. 50%. Assassinations give one extra adrenaline segments bonus. Now, I guess the real question is, with that, when it says uh, crit damage, like, I don't, I don't think there's a character stats screen there our damage I guess what I'd want to see is for example when I pick like this crit damage is increased by 50% does that mean that my crit damage in general goes up to a baseline of 50% or is it specifically only to assassinations? And the other thing is, like, take this, for example, you know, assassination, um, blah, 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 automatically loot after an assassination. It says assassination is increased by 40%. Crit damage is increased by 50 so I think it means crit damage in general. And then how does that tie into this? If this is 200%, but I have this, which is 40%, is this actually 240 I do not know. These are the questions that I want answers to. That's one of the things, like, as much as I get burnt out of playing Diablo because I've played it so many times, that's one of the best things about Diablo, hands down, is that all of that shit is broken down. And you have a character spreadsheet that literally tells you, you know, crit damage, crit chance, attack speed, exactly what bonuses you're getting, how much they're benefiting you, how much they're boosting your DPS. Like, I love that level of granularity when it comes to class building. city. And my next quest is the one to go back go back to Athens. Oh no, that's right. I wanted one more fragment. Okay. So, let's take a look at the cultists. Who can we kill? Can't kill you. You're 29. You, I could probably kill. But I'll look at some other guys. Investigate this clue. Do I have... A, is there like a bunch of clues in my inventory? Is that what it is? No. No, 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 no. It's like actual clues. So, my troops need fresh meat. We need more than some of the Malachi's cows stole. All of them. They overheard saying they're going to Corinthia sell goods on the black market. When all fall, we stand. A clue to cultists can be oh bought in Corinthia, so it's probably sold by a blacksmith there. That's what it probably meant when it said you know there's a cultist clue nearby. Um. Oh, we you. Level 24. Oh, the piece of the Agamom set. Well, sir, uh, I think it's time to track and kill. 5,000 to the north. Will be a. It's gonna be the closest thing I have to that. Yeah, well, I got two choices here. I could run across 
could run across Attica, swim. <laughs> no, we're just gonna do this. We're gonna we're gonna have to. We'll go to Pirates' Revenge and we'll sail north. Now I'll get me another piece of my set. Another thing. I mean, given that they're, they're still, you know, AC is still very much new to the uh, the RPG archetype here, but. I like partial sets. You know, it's something we see in Neo, it's something we see in uh, Diablo, it's something we see in a lot of games. Partial sets, if you're going to have set bonuses, gotta have partial. Because, two reasons. One, it gives the person something to work towards. Like, right now, while I know eventually I'm going to be fully kitted out in an Agamon set, uh, until I have the full set, you know, I don't really have a huge benefit in running this thing. It's just like, you know, burning damage is burning damage, I guess. But I'm going to use whatever pieces I have nearby that seem decent. Whereas on the flip side of things, if you have partial bonuses, you know, like for example, make it so the five piece of the set has the current bonus of, um, you know, fire burn rate increased by 50%. Give it so that when you get three out of five pieces, fire damage is increased by 25%. And then, you know, you actually have a really nice set where, you know, like, oh, this is the fire set, you know, we have, when you when you hit three pieces, it's going to ramp up your fire damage, and you can, that's on all the gear too, and then at uh, max, it, you know, makes enemies burn out twice as fast. Let's go! Can't keep going at this speed! Let's move! Wait a minute here. Oh, I'm sitting here like, wait a minute, the cultist is right there. No, that's Athens, I'm stupid. Right this way. Really? This doesn't even seem that bad. The Adrestia was built to survive the worst storms and the toughest battles. But she was meant to sail on waters as glorious as these. A deck. Doc. Deck. Until I've been playing too much magic. You really want some pirate? Wait, 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 wait. Are these guys serious? I can't dock because these pirates want to have a go at me? That's really good, the, the volley where they go to shoot fire and then they shoot again. God, dude, this is fucked. I'm dead. 
that other ship, man. The little pirate ship I was shredding, but the big boy behind me just... Ugh. I really need to sink some upgrades into the damn ships, but it's so expensive! Fuck, Ubisoft. I mean, it's already ridiculous just to try and keep your weapons and gear upgraded. It's like they, they really do want you to, to buy the pack. That's the thing. They want you to pay for the super bonus materials pack. You never, for only nineteen ninety nine, you'll never have to worry about materials again. The watch will be vigilant here. Where did it just take me to? Oh, you gotta be fucking kidding me. I'm all the way back at Pirate's Revenge? Hell no. Man, that was not a... Oh my god. That makes me salty. Alright, I'm about to just... I'm about to, to cut this recording, start a stream, and do nothing until... Just sail and murder until my ship is upgraded. We have... Lost the fearless crook. Twenty three, you have a blunt. I want that blunt weapon. Sorry, Dogo. Yeah, I'm friends of the pirates. Now you picked the wrong island to come to. Sledgehammer. Good is the question. It is. Hunter. Ugh, fuck. I mean, the fire damage is nice, but really, a hunter and assassin? Ugh. You know what? I'm going to take it just for the DPS increase. Not warrior, but it burns at least. Just disappointing, though. Looks cool. Alright, and I know we're already at 30 minutes, but after getting sent back, I'm kind of like, eh, no, that ain't gonna happen. Like, I'm, I'm sailing the ship out. I mean, after I sail the ship out and, and kill the cultist, I, you know, I'll wrap up the video there. There's no point in me doing, uh, the upgrades on the video. You quite literally just go there and... No, I don't know. I guess I could do the upgrades. We'll figure it out. Let's see. Let's see if this cultist is still where he, uh, he was. Yes, he is. Come on! Drop the sail! They hear another tune! Sorry, but you were in the way.
Thing of the week. I don't even know what that was for, but I will take it. Huge amount of XP. Now the question is, can I get into port without all these pirates? Actually, just in case, let me uh, make a quick save it right now. So if this army of pirates suddenly decides that they all want to attack, I'm not having it. Buddy over here also wants to mess around. Oh, you're on fire. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. When ships are on fire, they don't move. Right there when I rammed, I didn't lose any health. So I'm thinking maybe that's one of the mechanics that's changed is you don't have to brace before you ram. You want to brace anytime you're about to take take a hit, but you don't need to um, or you would ram. A shark? That is a huge shark right there. Ah, look at that thing. Gotta be a great white. All right, thankfully I managed to dock before he engaged. Oh, uh, oh, whatever. All right, so we're already over 30 minutes, but we're going. We're in the home stretch. I'm killing this fucking cultist. These ruins are a good reminder of the devastation the Persians left behind. Wait, 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 ruins. Oh, no. Never mind. Put your backs into it. Retrie isn't going to rebuild itself. Um, you know what? Before I let me see something. Here. Got other cultists from the same branch to gain a clue. And there's that. And there's him. So what I could do. I could go to the silver mine. You know what? That's what we're going to do. I'm going to wrap up because we're at 34 minutes. But the first part tomorrow, we are going to hunt down this entire area, the whole silver vein, including the sage, if we can kill him. And I'm going to get that set done. So stay tuned. And I will see you guys then with a cultist hunt.